Lord, open our lips, and we shall praise your name. The Lord is a great King, come let us adore him. The Lord is a great King, come let us adore him. Come ring in our joy to the Lord. Hail the God who saves us. Let us come before him giving thanks with songs that assail the Lord. The Lord is a great King. Come let us adore him. A mighty God is the Lord. A great King above all gods. In his hand are the depths of the earth. The heights of the mountain are his. To him belongs the sea, for he made it. And the dry land shaped by his hands. The Lord is a great king. Come, let us adore him. Come in, let us bow and bend low. Let us kneel before the God who made us. For he is our God and we, the people who belong to his pasture, the flock that is led by his hand. The Lord is a great King, come let us adore Him. Oh, that today you would listen to His voice. Harden not your hearts as a Mariba, as on that day at Mass or in the desert, when your fathers put me to the test. When they tried me, though they saw my word. The Lord is a great King, come let us adore Him. For forty years I was weary of these people, and I said their hearts are astray. These people do not know my ways. Then I took an oath in my anger, never shall they enter my rest. The Lord is a great King, come let us adore Him. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son Jesus Christ the Lord. To the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. The Lord is a great King, come let us adore Him. <laughs> O Christ, the light of heaven and of the world through light, you come in all your radiance to cleave the web of night. May what is false within us before your truth give way that we may live untroubled with quiet hearts this day. May steadfast faith sustain us, and hope made firm in you. The love that we have wasted, O God of love, renew. Blessed Trinity, we praise you, in whom our quest will cease. Keep us with you forever, in happiness and peace. The man with clean hands and pure heart will climb the mountain of the Lord. 
The Lord is the earth and its fullness, the world and all its peoples. It is he who set it on the seas, on the waters he made it firm. Who shall climb the mountain of the Lord? Who shall stand in his holy place? The man with clean hand, pure heart, who desires not worthless things, was not sworn to as to deceive his neighbor. He shall receive blessings from the Lord and reward from the God who saves him. Such are the men who seek him. Seek the face of the God of Jacob. O gates, lift high your head. Grow higher, ancient doors. Let him enter the King of glory. Who is the King of glory? The Lord, the mighty, the valiant. The Lord, the valiant in war. O gates, lift high your hands. Grow higher, ancient doors. Let him enter the King of glory. Who is he, the King of glory? He, the Lord of armies. He is the King of glory. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. The man with clean hands and pure heart will climb the mountain of the Lord. Praise the King of the ages in all your deeds. Blessed is God who lives forever, and blessed is his kingdom. For he afflicts and he shows mercy. He leads down to Hades and brings up again, and there is no one who can escape his hand. Acknowledge him before the nations, O sons of Israel, for he has scattered us among them. Make his greatness known there, and exalt him in the presence of all the living, because he is our Lord and God. He is our Father forever. He will afflict us for our iniquities, and again he will show mercy. But see what he will do with you. Give thanks to him with your full voice. Praise the Lord of righteousness, and exalt the King of the ages. I give him thanks in the land of my captivity, and I show his power and majesty to a nation of sinners. Turn back, you sinners, and do right before him. Who knows if he will accept you and have mercy on you? I exalt my God. My soul exalts the King of heaven and will rejoice in his majesty. Let all men speak and give him thanks in Jerusalem. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Praise the King of the ages in all your deeds. Praise is fitting for loyal hearts. Bring out your joy to the Lord, are you just? For praise is fitting for loyal hearts. Give thanks to the Lord upon the heart. With a ten-string harp, sing him songs. Oh, sing him a song that is new. Play loudly with all your skill. For the word of the Lord is faithful, and all his works to be trusted. The Lord loves justice and right, and fills the earth with his love. 
by his word the heavens were made. By the breath of his mouth all the stars. He collects the waves of the ocean. He stores up the depths of the sea. Let all the earth fear the Lord. All who live in the world revere him. He spoke and it came to be. He commanded it sprang into being. He frustrates the designs of the nations. He defeats the plans of the peoples. His own design shall stand forever. The plans of his heart from age to age. They are happy whose God is the Lord. The people he has chosen as his own. From the heavens the Lord looks forth. He sees all the children of men. From the place where he dwells he gazes on all the dwellers on the earth. He who shapes the hearts of them all and considers all their deeds. A king is not saved by his army nor a warrior preserved by his strength. A vain hope for safety is the horse. Despite its power it cannot save. The Lord looks on those who revere him. On those who hope in his love. To rescue their souls from death. To keep them alive in famine. Our soul is waiting for the Lord. The Lord is our help and our shield. In Him do our hearts find joy. We trust in His holy name. May your love be upon us, O Lord as we place all our hope in you. To the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, give praise for every man. Praise is fitting for loyal hearts. You must wake up now. The night is almost over. It will be daylight soon. Let us give up all the things we prefer to do under cover of the dark. Let us arm ourselves and appear in the light. Let us live decently as people do in the daytime. My helper is my God. I will place my trust in him. My helper is my God. I will place my trust in him. He is my refuge. He sets me free. My helper is my God. I will place my trust in him. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. My helper is my God. I will place my trust in him. The Lord has raised up a mighty saviour for us, as he promised through the lips of his prophets. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has visited his people and redeemed them. He has raised up for us a mighty saviour in the house of David his servant as he promised by the lips of all men 
those waste prophets from of old, a saviour trees from our foes, from the hands of all who hate us, so his love for our fathers is fulfilled, and his holy covenant remembered. He swore to Abraham our father, to grant us that tree from fear, and save from the hands of our foes, we might serve him in holiness and justice, all the days of our life in his presence. As for you, little child, you shall be called a prophet of God the Most High. You shall go ahead of the Lord to prepare his ways before him, to make known to his people their salvation through forgiveness of all their sins, the loving kindness of the heart of our God, who visits us like the dawn from on high. He will give light to those in darkness, those who dwell in the shadow of death, and guide us into the way of peace. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. The Lord has raised up a mighty Saviour for us, as He promised through the lips of His prophets. As Christians called to share the life of God, let us praise the Lord Jesus, the High Priest of our faith. You are our Saviour and our God. Almighty King, you have baptised us and made us a royal priesthood. May we offer you a constant sacrifice of praise. You are our Saviour and our God. Help us to keep your commandments, so that through your Holy Spirit we may dwell in you and you and us. You are our Saviour and our God. Everlasting wisdom come to us, dwell with us, and work in us today. You are our Saviour and our God. Help us to be considerate and kind. Grant that we may bring joy, not pain, to, to those we meet. You are our Saviour and our God. At the Saviour's command, and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Look with favour on our morning prayer, Lord, and in your saving love, let your light penetrate the hidden places of our hearts. May no disordered desires darken our minds, renewed and enlightened, as we are by your heavenly grace. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, 
who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. May the Lord bless us and keep us. Amen. May he let his face shine upon us and show us his mercy. Amen. May he turn his countenance towards us and give us his peace. Amen. And may the blessing of Almighty God, the Father and the Son, and the Holy Spirit come down on us and remain with us forever. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks be to God.